Our next guest is an award-winning actress who has starred on stage and screen. Ruth Wilson has taken on a wide range of characters, from the Broadway production of Constellations to TV series like Showtime's The Affair and HBO's His Dark Materials. Ruth's latest project is a new film. It's called True Things, a psychological drama. She plays Kate, a woman living a seemingly mundane life until she meets a charming stranger. Her chance encounter with the mysterious man leads to an infatuation that consumes her. I thought you might have called. I've been busy. You just disappeared. You... What? When? When I went to the supermarket. I left you a note. Yeah, I know, but I thought you might have just, you know, called just to say... I don't know, just to say... It's a two-way street, Kate. You could have called me. I did. Did. Oh man! I did. Dun, dun, dun. Ruth, good morning. It's good so nice morning. To you. Uh, so describe. I, I like the way you describe this film because I feel like you know everybody has been in or knows somebody who's been in this toxic relationship that you know you shouldn't be in and you really don't notice it until after the fact. So yeah. how would you describe this? Well, movie? it is like a l rite of passage relationship that we've all been in. That five years later you're like, why on earth did I engage <laughs> in that relationship? Um, and I was always really interested in those sort of first throws of a relationship. It feels like infatuation yeah. and it can feel really obsessive yeah. and you're blind to the realities of the situation. Someone described it as the sort of Midsummer Night's Dream effect of the sort of yeah. romance dust on a relationship and you fall in love with a donkey and then <laughs> eventually you wake up and realise he's just a donkey. Ho hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you wake up. <laughs> hopefully you wake up, yeah. Uh, Could be ten years later, right. but you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I understand this is also the first feature that that you uh, worked with Jula on in terms of producing. Yeah. Is, how did you guys become involved in this project? We together? did a play together about ten years ago called Anna Christie uh, in London, and his producing partner brought me a book uh, which they were interested in and said, "Do you think this is worth making into something?" And I read it and said, "Yeah." So we bought the rights to the novel and adapted it for the screen. That's cool. But it was about that kind. I found it was a really um, subjective view, a female perspective on this very sort of intense moment in people's relationships. And I, ha I felt like that hadn't been seen on screen before. Um, so I was really interested in, yeah, making it. I thought it was interesting. I was reading that this movie was in the works for years, right? Yes. And then 2020 comes and everybody just gets, you know, thrown Yeah, I mean, loop. like, y movies take, you know, they can take a year to make or they can take sort of five years to make. And this had taken quite a long time, gestation period. But then, of course, we had one week of filming, eventually got to filming. And then it was March 2020 oh, and yeah. COVID yeah, happened. Yeah. So we were shut Maybe down for four months, mm -hmm. five months. And in that time, the director, who's a woman called Harry Whitliffe, she was pregnant in March and she had a baby by September. So <laughs> she was on set with a six-week-year-old mm -hmm. wow. suckling baby on set. Wow. It was amazing. Yeah, it was actually really wonderful to have a baby there. Yeah, kind of... babies just kind of make you feel better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was cute hearing it in the back of, you know, back of takes. Just yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, you received quite the honor, so I want to make sure I say this right, because we don't have anything like this around here. Uh, you were made a member of the Order of the British Empire, yes. which is quite the honor. So a little bit of royalty here in studio. And Princess oh. Anne gave you the award. Can you just tell me what that's like to receive that? Yeah, it's amazing, really. It's these, these awards are given out, and they're given out to all members of the public for different things, for whether dedication to their particular field or dedication to things they've done in the community. Um, so actually, they're huge, wonderful honours. You get to go to the Buckingham Palace and meet one of the royals, mm -hmm. and they give it out to you. Uh, I met loads of people there who had done things for COVID, actually, who had done mm. different things across the country, um, dedication of service to the country in some way. And that's what they are honouring, really. We, we've been calling you Ruth all morning. Should we be... Dame. Using... It's not Dame yet. OK. But... <laughs> not yet. But not you, yet. Should, you maybe You're should curtsy to me. Maybe, maybe you should curtsy. Bow. Yeah. Bow. Yeah. That's good. That's good. yeah, I've missed the curtsy, uh, yes. guys. One yes. by one. I'll dodge them. Come back when you're a dame. Yeah, there you go. I love it. Really quickly, I heard, this is fun, that if you could choose an alternate career, you'd be an archaeologist? Is that true? Well... I'm a little bit of a historian. I did that at university. I love sort of when things are found out about prehistoric, you know, artifacts found yeah. in some, you know, yeah. I don't know, yeah. 
car park somewhere, I get really excited. So, Did you hear about the dinosaurs? Yes, in Texas. Just, yeah, Look I was at looking at crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was so fascinated by that. I'm always fascinated by the past. Why can I go to a museum and get you a little brush set? You know, you get the brush. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I need to be a new Indiana Jones. There you right? go. When you're on yeah. the set, you can go oh, off. There you go. Put yeah. it out there. <laughs> Ruth, thank you so much. It was thank so lovely you. to talk with you. This Almost morning. dangerous. Yes. Almost dangerous. Uh, Almost, yeah. True Things. It's out in theaters and video on demand on September 9th. Thank you, Ruth. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.